What's up, good people? Welcome back to Stock Up with Larry Jones. I'm outside, so you'll hear some stuff. Um, I want to say to you, those of you that's new to the page, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And those of you that are not getting the notifications, make sure that notification bell is checked. Today, we're going to talk about two energy companies that are exploding. They both have new contracts. They're both will double this year, minimally, conservatively, I think. And uh, that and more. We'll be right back. Okay, first, a little house cleaning. If you guys see any correspondence that look like it's me, they talk about a WhatsApp, they leave a phone number, or they say, get in contact with my broker or private consultation or Discord channel. It is not me. It is spam. Don't fall for it, good people. If you just click on it there to their uh, icon, you'll see they, they have five or ten subscribers. And as you can see, we have a little more than that. All right, let's keep it rolling. Um, um, I made a video a few days ago talking about how we need to pick stock, right? In 2020, it's, it was easy to pick stock because we can just pick industries. You could have just bought a SPAC or bought an EV and you would have made money. Now we have to be careful and we have to carefully pick our stock. So what I do in a market like this is I look at emerging markets. And one of those are in the fuel cell industry. And these two stock are in the fuel industry and they are both uh, in the charging station uh, industry for electric vehicles because that is an emerging market. It is here to stay. Even if there's an EV bubble that will pop, these industries will continue to grow over a period of time. As a matter of fact, I'll boldly, I will boldly suggest, because no one knows, that both of these stock pick will be double. Um, I conservatively will double by the end of this year in the next 11 months. Um, and so that's 100% return on your money, right? But this is what I think. Remember, I am not your financial broker. Before you make any financial decision, you should first do your own research and then secondly, consult with your financial advisor to which I am not, right? I just put some eye drops in my eyes, so I'm dilating a little bit, so I'm gonna put these glasses on. All right, All right so um, hopefully I can pull this up on you guys' screen as well, because I want you to see um, what's going on with both of these companies. Let's talk about Plug first. Look at here, Plug Power's deal I'm sorry, Plug Power's deal with Renault will push Plug stock above $100. Look at where it is right now. Look at this. Read that. Shares of hydrogen fuel sale make, uh, maker Plug Power, all right, soared mid January after the company announced a landmark partnership with major automobile manufacturer Renault Group, in which the two will jointly design a hydrogen powered light commercial vehicle or LCVs for use in Europe. Plug stock popped more than 15% on this news. Plug stock also has popped more than 250% over the last three months, right? These are the type of moves that you want to be in. Now, for those of you that say, yeah, it already popped 250%. Look at where it is now and look at where it's saying it's going to be. And I think that's conservatively with plug, right? And so what we have to understand is this is an emerging market. I also think that in 2022, by the end of 2022, that this stock will be up 250 to 300%. And that's what I mean by getting in an emerging market early and not waiting. Remember the lesson a lot of you learned on Tesla. When Tesla was 200, it went to 500. You said it's too late to get in. And you didn't get in. Then it went to 700. And he says, oh, ah, I didn't know it was going to do that. Now it's really too late. Then it went to 900. Then it went to 1,000. Then it went to 2,000. 
at some point in in emerging markets that means markets that's going to grow over a period of time you have to just get in right and so for those of you saying oh there's going to be a crash do you know how much money i've made since the whole crash theory started i do believe that there's going to be a pullback or a correction but not a crash but i have a stock that is in the fuel cell industry that I'm up 348%, right? So, and I have a trailing stop loss of 15% on the stock. So all, I'm up 300, over 300%. So if I only lose 15%, what? I win. So I don't worry about a stock market crash. But for those of you that worry about a stock market crash, you know what the percentage of times, uh, what the percentage is on how many times the stock market recovers after a crash? 100. The stock market recovers from a crash. 100%. So when you read these comments under here and you see these naysayers and these, they trying to keep you from your blessing. Good people. Don't don't let the brokers do that to you, right? Remember, there's car brokers, real estate brokers, financial brokers, and there's neighborhood brokers. They broke they broke and they want you broke er. Don't listen to the neighborhood brokers. Unfortunately, some of you guys are married to them. Some of them are your mothers, your fathers, your your your, your neighbors, your relatives. And um all I could say is consider the source, right? I'm sorry to to, to come at you like that. But I want you guys to think because I want you to be financially free. And the only way you're going to be financially free is to free your mind. All right. The second one I want to talk about is I have to give you these principles with the stock. Right. So the second one I'm going to talk about just off the top of my head is switchback energy. SBE. Charge point. It's going to double this year. I believe with over 78 um, percent um, of the market. And now they just signed the deal in Canada uh, with a gas stations, a chain of gas stations in Canada. So you'll be able to get gas and you'll be able to charge a vehicle. This is this is SBE, right? Switchback. And they're going to in, on January, January the 11th. The merger is going to go through. It's a SPAC. For those of you that know, special purpose acquisition company, ChargePoint is a SPAC, right? But President Obama, I'm sorry, President-elect Biden says he wants 500,000 charging stations. And they have 78% of the market share already. So what is that telling you? There's money to be made. And so for those of you that's new, I want you to do your research because I don't want you to miss out on this money. It's more money than than I could ever uh, get. And this is what I want to tell you. Those are the two stock. But I just want you to hang with me for like two more minutes because I want you to get this in your spirit and in your head. Like right now, I'm here at my one of my best friends uh, house, Todd and Renee Matchett. Right. This is his beautiful pool. This is his beautiful house. This is not mine, right? So, and, and I'm, I'm, the only reason I'm out here is because I'm trying to suck up this warm weather as much as possible before I go back to that frozen tundra called Chicagoland, all right? But I want to tell you guys that you have to get in an emerging market early and don't worry about the downside not don't worry about the downside but don't worry about the naysayers right if i thought it was only enough money to fill this pool up then maybe i might be a little quiet right i always use the terminology if i was in a desert and i went over a sand hill and i found a bottle of water and and there was a thousand other people i might drink it because i'm thinking everybody's going to die anyway right or I might give it to my loved one and say, hey, it's not enough to go around. Somebody's going to live another hour. But this is an ocean, people. It's an ocean of money. Trillions of dollars of money in the market. I could never drink an ocean. Eventually, I could drink that. 
over some time. But I can never drink an ocean. So I'm running back over the sand hill and I'm telling the multitude, come get this water. So I'm telling you guys, come get this money, right? And then I want you guys to do me a favor. Share my page with as, as many people as you can because I know that there's millionaires watching this page. I know for a fact they've contacted me. I know that there's, there's people doing well off and I, I want you guys to stay here and get this information. But what I'll say is kind of bold. I'll probably be the only YouTuber that say this, but I'm gonna look you in the camera and say, I'm not that interested in making millionaires billionaires. But what I'm interested in is making the average American millionaires, or at least financially wealthy, or at least enough to pay off your house and your cars and to get out of debt and don't worry about money. That's what I'm interested in. That's the legacy I wanna leave on this earth, all right? So those of you that come here, you get the stock, but you get this stuff too. I, I, I can't be nobody else but me. So I love every one of you guys. And what I love about you guys is we're all racist. We're all ages. We're all everything, all genders. And that's what I love about the stock of family. Okay. I'm not going to ramble on, but I want you guys to look at these two stocks, plug and SBE. And I know I've been really bullish on SBE, but it keeps making money. Right. And so, um, until next time, Live, love, laugh, and learn. And I'm sorry about the eye situation. I probably should give a little more time between putting it in my eyes and shooting. <laughs> Have a good one. We love you guys. Peace.